We're working on getting this reinforcement C channel out with the rear leaf. Uh, I've ground off all these top rivets and pop them through. Working on getting these ones now. I was able to grind those two out. Just got those. And I used a reciprocating saw down here and got those. And I gotta do this side. Day two of rivet removal. Lots of drilling, lots of drilling. Through all the rivets. Pilot hole followed by a larger size steel drill bit. Lots of oil. way is to pre-drill a small little pilot and then drill out uh, a larger hole and then hit it out and through with the punch. I ground off the tops of all the rivets first and I'm going to punch them through. Both sides out. C channel reinforcement. Snap's so got to order up some new ones, get them bolted in. Also, found out that somebody started to remove these rivets. They're grinding them from the underside, so I'm gonna have to chop them off, pop out the rivets, and then bolt those up instead now as well. I welded it in place temporarily, so we'll just sit there. That's it. Okay, I got my C channels in the mail the other day. So I'm just finishing the last two bolts above the spring mounts. Once I get those out, I'm gonna rust proof this and pop these guys in. Pretty excited to see how that goes. Okay, got the last two rivets out. Now I'm gonna clean up all this rust. Neutralize it with POR's neutralizer and then probably just uh, rattle can it and spray it. So, to start, I've got to ream out all these holes so it matches the uh, nuts and bolts that were supplied with these guys. Uh, they're in imperial size, I believe, so got to do that first. brushed in here now and degrease it and then rust neutralize it and then put in the C channel. So 
I've been using POR15 metal prep. Start getting this ready for the new C-channel. Just letting it dry now. You can see it's uh, changed the rust or neutralized the rust and given it like a zinc coating. And then I've uh, just given a quick black spray on the inside of the C-channel. And I'll give this a spray as well of a light paint. That way the C-channel will fit in there and I'll bolt it down and that'll be it. And I'll finish, uh, I'm gonna start on the, the frame, getting off all the flaky rust and then I'll neutralize all the rust and POR it. I quickly sprayed these just with a spray Rust-Oleum paint. Um, I don't wanna put the POR in here just because I'm afraid that uh, the C-channel won't fit. I just gave it a quick uh, spray and then we'll try to put the C-channel in there and tighten it up. Structured, and then this whole thing will then get covered in POR when I do the whole body. 